Unfortunately, we all run into programs that lock up in Windows from time to time. However, there is a quick way to get that program unlocked and get yourself back up and running without too much time and without having to restart your computer. And the way to do it is using what's called the Windows Task Manager. The Windows Task Manager has been around in various forms since Windows 3.1. And in Windows 95 and forward, all you need to do is push Control, Alt, and Delete on your keyboard. And that will bring up the Windows Task Manager, except for Windows Vista, which you have to push Control, Alt, Delete, and then say Start Task Manager. And that's just because Windows Vista is so much faster and so much easier and requires less work. Please note the sarcasm in my voice. Once the task manager is running, you'll see these different tabs at the top of the task manager. If the applications tab is selected, you'll see any programs that are currently running on your system that you invoked, not things that started up automatically, but things that you invoked either through an icon or through the start menu. So in this case, if my Outlook Express was not responding it would come over here to the status and say not responding so I can simply click the application I want to close and choose end task here at the bottom and by doing that it will force that particular application to close now not always will that come up just quick and easy as we did just now sometimes you'll have to highlight it and hit end task more than one time a second little tip that you can do is move over to the processes tab and if you're not having luck with the Applications tab, you want to be more careful here. But in the Processes tab, you can kill a program even quicker. And the way you do this is you click on the title called Image Name here, the title of the column. It will sort the list alphabetically, as you can see here. And then I can select one of the programs that I want to force to quit. And let's say this one here, which is a Java update library thing. If I don't want that to be running, I can just highlight it, click in process, it'll say are you sure, and I'll say yes in the process, and it'll kill that process. Now again, you only want to use this technique with programs that are having problems, or programs that you want to forcefully quit because you've lost track of an icon or somehow have not been able to shut it down in the normal fashion. So use Control alt delete and the task manager to troubleshoot those programs that tend to lock up from time to time in Windows and you will find that you can get back to work much quicker and easier.